you guys, it's me, Yabba Dabba Doodles, and today we are going to be learning how to make our mascot the baby pencil. Yes, a little baby pencil. It is so cute. And some of them even have diapers. Well, at least I call them diapers. Some people call them pencil toppers. Some people call them erasers. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Some people even call them just attachable erasers. But, uh, yeah, see here, I... Made a little drawing of it, or a little mascot baby pencil. And then over here you can see, uh, Mr. Mr. Turtle, yes, Mr. Turtle. He helps me with all my work in all my videos. Uh, shout outs to Mr. Mr. Turtle. Let's come over here and give him a little pat pat on the head. Anyways, uh, yeah, so what you're gonna do is, you're gonna wanna have, um, one of these, like, kinda sorta bendable pencils, like, but you, the reason why you want one of these is because with a normal pencil that's like wooden, like this one, it'll break easily. Well, not easily, but it'll like, when you break it, the shards of wood will come sticking out and that makes it harder to sharpen. So what we're gonna do is, so step one, uh, if you have a long pencil, you're gonna wanna break it in half or something, so, yeah. Okay, here you see I broke mine in half, see? Uh, if yours is already short like this, then kudos to you, you you're kind of already finished. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And then what you're going to want to do is if it's, if it's not sharpened at the top, you're going to want to sharpen it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my little baby baby piranha sharpener over here in my little goodie bag. Yes, I got a couple things from Dollar Tree today and some of this is trash or just stuff I put in here for storage. Like my hairbrush and that giant uh, thing of hand sanitizer that I bring with me to practically everywhere I go because hey, you know, uh, flu, flu season. Yeah. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sharpen my pencil. Now, as you can see, I have sharpened both of my little baby pencils. Now, if you have a flat end like this, um, what you're going to want to do, um, so that it doesn't look all plain and rusty and stuff, is you're going to want to take one of these little itty-bitty pencil toppers or pencil erasers um, either way you're probably gonna want want to take one like this not anything that's like one of those shaped uh, pencil toppers like I don't know if you have like a cupcake one or like I remember having this um, rose one when I was real little um, on my pencils one of those little pencil topper toppers or or erasers you're gonna want to have one of these because if you don't then it's gonna wind up looking weird and it's not really gonna look like a diaper <laughs> so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to put the eraser on the ends of the pencils but if you have a pencil like this or like that has the metal thing on it um, you do not have to put the erasers on there because that would look weird and you know you know what I mean, like, it, it would just look straight up weird, and, you know, it's just, the metal would still be showing, so if you have one like this that still has an eraser, and it still has the metal on it, and it's not broken off, then feel free to keep that on, and you don't have to put a pencil topper on, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to slide these pencil toppers on here, and... Yeah, uh, okay, now that you have slid your little diaper, aka eraser, or pencil topper on your baby pencil, you are now, you are now good to go with some little baby pencils, or maybe one, maybe you just found a tiny pencil that doesn't have the end on it, so you just want to, uh, fancy it up a bit, or maybe you just have, like, an old pencil that you found lying around that's, like, one of the bendish, like, the bendy-ish pencils that, like, 
you're just bored and that where you're like you're just bored out of your mind and you're just like uh I just want something to do, you know? So I understand, I completely understand. I was there before too. So uh you know, feel free to uh you know, let me know in the comments if you want me to do anything else next. Uh, art suggestions, you know. Uh, don't forget to check out our website, yabadabadoodles.com. Um, well, not ours, because... Oh, well. <laughs> but still, it's really fun making these videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!